Jim Wells for a question. Mr. Wells. Eight. Sir Alan Maclay was an outstanding entrepreneur. His personal vision and dedication to the life sciences sector made an enormous contribution to economic development in Northern Ireland. He also contributed hugely to wider economic development in Northern Ireland through his membership of the group established to work with the US envoy Declan Kelly to attract investment and support the export ambitions of our local companies. Lest we forget, Sir Alan provided significant personal funding to support healthcare research and its commercial exploitation. He also donated £20 million for the benefit of chemistry education at Queen's University to further expand scientific discovery. Mr. Wells, for a supplementary. Needless to say, Mr. Deputy Speaker, I agree with every word that the Minister said about this remarkable individual. Would she agree with me that we need to identify people to succeed Alan McClay to carry on the good work? We need to nurture them and promote them. And would she agree with me the basic message is we need lots more of people of the calibre of Alan McClay? Well, I, I couldn't agree more uh, with the uh, member. I, I will say this, however. I think Sir Alan McClay uh, was a unique uh, individual. Uh, he treated the company at Almac and, I am told previously, at Galen as his extended family. Uh, and uh, Although he was a man of great wealth and, indeed, uh, a knight of the realm, he was known to everybody in Almac as just Alan. And uh, I think he was a very humble man. Uh, he was a man who we should all uh, look up to, not just for his personal uh, attributes, but the fact that, as the member has indicated, he was a great entrepreneur uh, for Northern Ireland. He stood out, and uh, we were all uh, greatly saddened uh, by his death in America some weeks ago. Uh, and I do want to pay my personal tribute to him. Um, indeed, uh, when we had the working group meeting with um, uh, Secretary of State Hillary Clinton and indeed the US envoy Declan Kelly. He uh, spoke out in his frank way, uh, and I must say I really did appreciate his frankness. Uh, when other people talk in florid terms, uh, Sir Alan could be uh, very direct, and I have to say that was appreciated by all of those of us uh, from uh, Northern Ireland. He was very intelligent. He was a, a man who we should all uh, look up to, and uh, indeed he will be sorely missed.